Hi all, so this is a couple of hours after the Garage Data Center 2 video. Things look like they're a bit more orderly. Let's walk around and see what we have. So here, I've put my boards back. Basically this is where I do certain designs and draw things up when I get ideas. Here is where I've put the two X340 IBMs. We actually have some problems with them, mainly with the... Uh, RAID controllers and some other BIOS issues, so we're basically going to use these for parts, CPU, memory, uh, and also the hard disks. Some good hard disks in there so we can take those out. Development workstation hasn't really moved, still where it is. The uh, valve cluster, basically we're going to take this apart so it's no longer a valve cluster, but it will still be in a, a certain type of cluster configuration, basically to support the application. Uh, this is what we mainly did yesterday, it's uh, the racking of all this equipment and uh, we've put a face first into the wall because we're going to do some cabling today, so uh, that's what we'll probably work on. We didn't get a chance to do any work on this rack because we had some issues with uh, racking some of the equipment with old rails not sliding in properly and having to basically bend them back into shape. Um, it's empty at the moment except for at the bottom because we've actually planned to group these Dells into groups of five, kind of strap them together and have them in here in a cheap man's blade, Dell blade configuration type thing. But yeah, we'll see how that one goes. And we have a lot of space now here. So uh, we've made some progress. Do some cabling today, uh, probably a bit of coding. And that's about it. Oh here, yeah, I've got my guitars here, where I, what I use when I'm, uh, when I'm wanting to relax a bit. So that's what we have. Uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully, I can release a Garage Data Center 4 video when, uh, you know, we've made some progress and have something else that we can show. That's about it. Thanks all for watching.